Good morning, everyone, and happy Thursday, Friday Eve. I'm NBC Files Anthony Carter in for meteorologist Bobby Johnston this week and starting to re maybe recover a little bit from the snowstorm that we had yesterday. It was nice to see some of those snow flurries here in the Rogue Valley and then, of course, a little east of the Cascades and in the mountains. Definitely saw a lot of snow just from looking at those trip check cameras earlier today. Taking a current look at our weather headlines today because of the snow, we're still dealing with some freezing temperatures and icy roads. That's pretty much across Southern Oregon, Northern California. So just kind of take your time out there on the roads this morning. That winter weather advisory has been extended. The good news is the warning expired earlier uh, earlier this morning, but the advisory has been extended. So you'll start to see some new snow in certain areas. I'll get to that in a bit. We'll get a break from the active weather tomorrow be mostly cloudy may see some sunshine before we start to see that rain return heading into next week taking a current look at our satellite radar within the last 30 minutes a national weather service uh national weather service member team member actually reported up to two inches of rain already accumulated on out along in uh, Gold Beach and in Curry County. So, and that rain will start to make its way inland just a little bit as we looking at our satellite radar little, later on this morning. Start to see a mix of those rain and snow showers and throughout parts of our area. And then as you're looking through much of uh, parts of unincorporated communities in Jackson County, like Prospect, for example, you'll start to see those mix of snow and then as well as east of the Cascades and some snow showers later on. Take a look at our pinpoint forecast by 11 this morning. Uh, le le yes, 11 this morning, start to see a little bit of those mix of snow um, heading more east and then in Northern California. And then later on tonight, we'll start to clear out just a little bit, start to see those increasing clouds near Lakeview as well. And then in Modoc County and then by Friday again, that's when it'll start to be clear. So we do get a little bit of a break. As I mentioned earlier, that winter weather advisory has been extended. St we'll see more snow in certain areas for Northern California. Additional snow accumulations is expected of up to one to three inches. This includes Wairica, Montague, Weed, and surrounding communities in Crater Lake, Crescent, Crescent Lake, and Diamond Lake can expect up to three to six inches of additional snow. Winds as high as 30 miles per hour, that's winds gusts. And one to two inches are expected across much of Jackson and Josephine County, that's only in elevations above 1,500 feet. That does include Prospect and surrounding communities. And then Prospect also reporting about four inches of snow on the side of the roads. And even in the uh, other parts and higher passes as well, reporting 18 inches of snow. That's in um, near the Crater Lake area. So just kind of take your time out there as well. Now, we did see those reports, as we mentioned earlier, just about uh, some spin outs that happened in California and then people stuck on the side of roads. So just kind of give us some driver tips just to keep you aware if you are driving in some snow later on today. Remember to check your tires beforehand. Have those chains available on standby. Remember to remove any ice and snow off your vehicles. And then remember, if you do start to skid, skid in the direction slowly so you can regain control. Taking a look at today, First for, for the coast, some showers are already starting to move in, but that'll clear out later on to some patchy fog, partly cloudy, high staying in about the 50s in our west side valleys. Start to see those rain and snow showers, snow levels again above 2200 feet. Later on tonight, start to get some patchy fog, then it'll turn into mostly cloudy. Temperatures dip into below freezing, same situation east of the Cascades, low hanging in the teens, highs of 30, 36 in Lakeview, start to get those increasing clouds later on tonight. Take a look at our seven day forecast first for the Rogue Valley. Highs this week in the 40s, chance of showers before clearing out on Friday. Snow showers out along the Klamath Basin, high of 38. Lows today heading into next week, staying in the teens to low 20s with the chance of snow from next Monday through Wednesday in Northern California. Snow showers today, partly cloudy Friday with a chance of rain and snow all throughout next week. And out along the coast, rain today, cloudy heading into Saturday before the rain returns on Sunday.